Right, another quick video. Wheel centers on the Land Rover Defender. This was something we mentioned a while back and it's taken us a while to get sorted. So if you put steel wheels, this only applies to steel wheels on your Land Rover Defender. We have got the 18 inch steel wheels. Why are steel wheels good, Will? Um, they're strong. They're strong and they're cheaper than alloys. Um, they're also, it's one of the smaller wheels you can get. And when you have smaller wheels means you can have bigger tires, which means a, if you're a rubbish driver like me and you're not going to curb, if you curb it, you're not going to damage your rims. But if you go off-roading, you've got more sort of bouncy bit, which is better for off-roading. Right, and you'll see that. Now, they came from factory with this sort of wheel cap, but it all looked a bit plastic and a bit like a lorry or a van or something. So we weren't that keen on that wheel. Um, they're not expensive, actually. Fair play to Land Rover, that is. Um, now, the other problem was they became expensive because they gripped, the way these fitted, it gripped onto the wheel nuts and you had to have special wheel nuts and the wheel nuts were like £10 each. And you do quick mass wheel, five wheel nuts on a wheel, four wheels on a car, 40 quid. 20 wheel nuts, £10 each, £200. £200? £200, £200 pounds just yeah. for the wheel nuts. You'll, you'll demonetize me with such oh, language, sorry. Will. Yes, apologise to everybody. That's rather surprising. Yes, that's rather surprising. Right then, so there we go. So that, so I said, well, actually, why don't we three D print some wheel centres like so, which we have done, and we designed them, and they've got these little clips. And then what we could do, come this way, is we could. Sh sh Tyler's got a day off today, and he. Right then, um, you could put the. Is it his birthday? Isn't it? Uh, Sunday. Sunday. There we go. Happy birthday, Tyler. Um, so I've done this one in blue just because we were doing it and I wanted to see and show you. And what this does is this takes a wheel centre. So these should, you have to fight them out. Um, oh, look at all the mud that's in there. Um, this takes a genuine Land Rover wheel centre and there's different ones available. Um, so we designed a little carrier so you could put a little... Right, so let's try and fit one of these, shall we, Will? So, okay. So it's got these little, now you've got, you can see, there's this sort of, the cast, the hub has got, but it leaves three gaps where you can see the wheel, the black bits on here, not the rusty bits. And you've got to line up these pegs with the, they fit into, okay, and then put those there, and then put those there. We should be able to get that last one in, is it going? There we go. Which, because you don't want these for the nap. And they can stay there. You can take the wheel off and leave that there. Just take your wheel nuts off. Um, and then you can insert your wheel center. There we go, like so. And I thought that was quite good. You've got your wheel nuts exposed and it looked better than that big plastic thing, if you like it. Right, so that's the first type. Now, someone said, oh, I'm not sure I want to put the wheel centers in. Can you just do a plain center one? Now, we have had these 3D printed and the prototypes work, but Julian's had a go and he says these might be a bit stiff. Now he seems to think that the where we've got the hole in this, because it's made from the same CAD data, it should be the same. But he thinks it might be able to twist a bit where it hasn't got this middle frame in. Does that make sense, Will? It does. Where you, where you haven't got that. So this is more solid. Um, so Julian's asked me to try this and I'm trying it. Right then. Okay, so we can take that. Take that wheel centre out, to which Julian's already put in for us. He was obviously testing that the other day. Right, and now let's see. This is the same CAD design, the same material. It should fit in fine. So let's have a let's have a look. Let's get those in, those in. Right, and it's just that last one there. There you go. Satisfying noise. Satisfying. So that snaps in. So they are tighter because of the reasons mentioned. But there you go. If you want just the plain, the plain look and you don't want to see that middle, we will make both of these available. So there we go. We'll get those on the website as soon as possible.